Welcome back. I've already did my eyebrows, so we're just gonna start off with our eyes. First, we're gonna go in with the transition color um, by Morphe in the color Spice, and we're just gonna apply this um, a little bit underneath our brow bone. Then we're gonna use windshield wiper motions to apply that. Then we're gonna go in with Toasted Hazelnut by Morphe as well and apply that directly right on top of that transition color, just to give it a little bit more uh, definition and to make it a little darker. Using the same windshield wiper motion. Continue to blend that out on both eyes. Blend, blend, blend. Next, we're going to go in with Game Face by um, ColourPop, and it's an ultra metallic, and we're going to apply this directly onto our lids. I did find that this um, eyeshadow was a bit hard to apply with this fluffy brush. So if you have a flat brush, I would recommend using that or maybe your fingers um, to put that on top of your lid. But for this, I did go ahead and just continue to do it with that. Next, I'm gonna take my Love in Rio by NYX in the um, Tri Palette, um, I think it's Moonlight or Moonlit Skinny Dip or something like that. And take that dark shade and just apply that right in our crease. Just to darken it and give it a little bit more definition. I'm just taking a Neutrogena Towelette Cleansing Wipe and just um, wiping off the excess fallout. And then I'm gonna go ahead and apply some foundation by um, Black Radiance and then Milani Conceal Imperfect in the color tan. I will leave everything in the description box below. I did go ahead and apply my foundation off camera because it was a little bit light, but I will show you guys. If you guys mess up with your um, foundation colors it is completely okay then I went ahead and applied my concealer off camera as well just my usual underneath my eyes on my bridge of my nose um, my cupid's bow and underneath on my chin and I just went ahead and blended that out next I'm gonna take my NYX concealer in the color I don't know I think it's like tan to deep or something like that I'll leave it down below and I did apply it with a beauty blender this time I don't know, I just wanted to do something different, um, but I did like the results that I um, came out with, that the Beauty Blender gave me when I was just blending it all out. I did have to go back and apply some more because I felt like my contour wasn't dark enough for me. So, just blending that out. I'm gonna take my Ben Nye Banana Powder and apply that everywhere where I applied my um, LA Girl Pro Concealer Highlight. And then I'm going to take my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit, the powder one in the colors Tan to Deep. I'm going to mix those three colors and just apply that where I um, applied my contour. Just give it me a little bit more definition and add some color back to my face since my foundation was too light. Then I'm just going to go back in with the Ben Nye Banana Powder and clean up my contour on the bottom. Then I'm going to take just a clean brush and sweep away all of that um, banana banana powder. Then I'm going to go in with the um, spiced color from Morphe and apply that to my water lid as well as um, this deep color in my MAC Neutral palette and apply that to my water lid as well, as well as applying the ColourPop 
into the center part of my um, water lid and then I'm gonna take my MAC blush in this color Swiss chocolate and apply that to the apples of my cheek. Then I'm gonna go in with my BH Cosmetics Forever Nude Sculpt and Glow and apply that cute highlight. I'm just loving this highlight. Like I grab this more than I grab any of my other highlights now that I've discovered that I've had it. Then I'm gonna go in with my Mika K Cosmetics um, lip pencil, sharpen it, make sure your lip pencils are sharpened and apply that um, all around my lips. I do overline my lips just a little bit to give them a much fuller effect because my lips are pretty small, but I don't overdo it. Then I'm gonna go in with my Kylie K um, matte lipsticks in the color Dulce K and just apply that. I love this color, this is literally my go-to. And I'm gonna just go ahead and blend those two, the lip pencil and the matte lipstick in together with my fingers. And there you have it for this look. Yes, loving it. I did wanna show you guys a different um, lip. So I went in with the color pop and the color limbo and applied that as well to my lips just to show you a little variety of um, lips that you can do with this look. I want to thank you guys for migrating back to my page. If you're new, welcome. Go ahead and subscribe for more looks. Um, if you guys have any questions, leave any comments below. Um, if you are requesting a specific look or something, a video you would like me to do, um, go ahead and leave a comment below. I just want to thank you guys for supporting me and bye.